From an early age, Hector Mahul has found himself playing soccer. I grew up in a country where soccer is pretty much religion. You know, since I could remember walking, uh, there's probably a soccer ball in between my feet. So it seems natural that when Hector came to Curry, he'd find himself a covenant player on our varsity team. I just love the passion and how it brings people together. Uh, there's a reason why it's the most popular sport in the world, uh, and I think that's, that's why I love it. As great of a soccer player as Hector is, we're not here to talk about Hector's soccer skills. Hector is actually one of the greatest hockey players in Mexico. Some people may wonder, how does somebody from Mexico even learn how to play hockey? It all starts with his sister, who was a figure skater at one of the only ice rinks in Mexico City. Where I would practice pretty much every day or go shoot around even if I didn't have practice. And most of the times so I'd go from there to the ice rink to pick up my sister who was skating. And after she got off the ice, the hockey team would go on. And eventually I f just wanted to try it one day, tied my skates and loved it. So the rest is history from there. It didn't take long for people to notice Hector's impressive skating skills and wanting him to play hockey. By age 14, Hector moved to Arizona where his new American family helped introduce him to the skills needed to play at an elite level. The first couple months were really tough. I'm happy I did it because I wouldn't be here or accomplish what I accomplished if I never took that first step on moving out of my family in the country. Hector still sees his Mexico family for about a month at a time over the course of a year. His family also gets to see him play, whether it is online or in person. They do follow me online and they watch every hockey game online. So, I mean, I know they're always watching. Uh, they may not be uh, watching in person, but I know they're, they're watching through the computer, which is always a huge support for me. Curry College's head hockey coach, TJ Manisterski, believes that Hector takes his high energy personality and puts it into his play, which affects his teammates and is beneficial to the team. It uh, doesn't matter if it's cold out, if he's tired or, or whatever, he's, he's always upbeat and working hard and uh, a smile on his face and loves to be at the rink, so it, that's contagious to everybody else. Curry's athletic director, Vinny Ruzioni, thinks it is important to recruit from all over the United States and from other countries in order to find more players like Hector. I think if you look at our hockey team, you see that we've got players from Sweden, Czechoslovakia, Mexico, uh, Canada. Uh, we've got them from all over the place, and I think that's, uh, that's important not only for our athletic teams, but for the college itself. Hector Mahul is the only Mexican player in the NCAA. He is the top player and one most valuable player for the Mexican national team. Hector has participated every year in the World Championship since 2014. Wearing the colors of your country and representing, uh, having, having the duty to put the name of your country up high is uh, something I'm extremely proud of. Hector eventually had to choose either hockey or soccer because they were both becoming too competitive. When it came time to choose, he told himself that he can either be the first Mexican to do something in hockey or he could be one of a million Mexican soccer players. I just wanted to be the first Mexican born hockey player to ever accomplish something big in the sport. You know, I want to be the first one to become pro. For Curry All Access, I am Vanessa Rizzitano reporting.